Hello everyone, welcome to today's class. <laughs> Look at this question here. How do we simplify this without the use of the calculator? It's very easy. I'm not going to waste time today. Now, so the question is the square root of five plus two into the square root of six minus the square root of five minus two into the square root of six. So without the use of the calculator, how do we simplify this? It's very easy. So yeah, we're going to take solution, all right? So solution. So how do we now bring out uh, a special inside this place that we have a radical of square root that we use to cancel out this? It's very easy. Now, let's take this product of this square root here, which is this radical here. For instance, if we have your x and you have your y, okay? Now, let's place this now. For your root 6, we can have your 1 times root 6. For your x being 1, y being root 6. At the center, we can have root 6, then 1, yeah. Again, we can equally split this to um, a kind of root 3, then root 2. Then, again, we can equally take x to be root 2, y. This gives us root 3, okay? So, either of these, we give us this product here. Now, we look for among these two that if we take the square of it, their sum, and it will give us something of this kind. Okay, I did this, this did it give us the answer, this did it, this gives us the answer. This also gives the answer too. So if we multiply the sum of this, we will arrive at this. Then if we multiply the, the, uh, the difference of this, Okay, square it rather. If you square it and multiply it, then it will give us this. So we can rewrite the whole of this expression in the format of your square of 3, then plus the square of 2, or squared minus here, same thing. So we have the square of square root of 5 minus, sorry, 3 here, please. All right. Now mind me. Yeah, we have 3 here, the square root of 2 r squared. So now we have a square root here, we have a square root here, where you have a square. So this can go with this, this goes with this. So we are now left with the square root of 3 plus the square root of 2 minus bracket the square root of 3, then uh, minus the square root of 2. Okay, so we can use this to open up this. So this will give us the square root of 3 plus the square root of 2 minus the square root of 3 plus the square root of 2. Again, this we go with this. So if we add this, this will give us 2 root 2. So this is the final answer without the use of calculator. Now again, if you try your hand on this, it will still give us the same answer. Okay, if you add this and this, square it, it will give you this. Okay, then if you subtract this from this, square it, it will give you this. Okay, so sorry, this. So if you do that from this, you also get the same answer. Okay, so this is all I have for you for today. Brief. Thanks for being there. Bye for now.